I'm going to use this as my Kiroko pusher. So I actually like to take it off the handle because it just feels better in my hand. I'm going to push back her Kiroko really quickly. Good evening, Max. Hi, John Lee. Thanks for watching. And if you guys are asking what is on my thumbnail, it is actually black acrylic because we just made a whole bunch today. So I was testing it out on myself. Oh, Moraima. Moraima? Aviles? Hello, Max. How are you? I'm great. And you? Sandra says, are you able to zoom in a little more? Um, we want to keep the shot a little bit wide. That way, if, if we zoom in too much, it'll be hard to keep in frame. So I like using our mixing tool as a cuticle pusher because it's more flexible. So that way it's less, um, less of a strain, I think, because it just really goes with the shape of the nail. I don't have to push too, too much because I'm going to use both my pink diamond cuticle bit and my diamond moon bit to prep the nail. Christy June Garcia. Hi, Max. Looking marvelous. Thank you. Thanks for watching today. Don't forget to like and share this video. So now I'm going to use the pink diamond cuticle bit and start prepping the nail. Beautiful. Look at that. I know. You excited, Ness? Oh my gosh. Two I years without nails. Oh my I gosh. Missed it. It's too long. It has been. Diamond bit to prep. Yes, the um, diamond moon bit will be used to remove the shine off the natural nail. We use that bit to etch. And the great thing about that bit is you can sanitize it. So say goodbye to your sanding bands, girl. No more sanding bands in your life. And then this weekend, I'm going to Lambcom, Alberta. You want to go with me? Of course. I'm off. Let's go party in Lamcom, I'm on, Alberta. I'm on vacation days right now. <laughs> Shout out to Nail Above the Rest. <laughs> um, Evan Copeland? Or Evan Copeland? Diamond bit to prep the nail. She says, please show me, save me. Yes, girl. Give me one minute. So when do you leave? Saturday. How long are you going to be gone? I will be weekend? teaching for three days. Teach. Yeah. A gel and an acrylic class. And then from there, I come back, and then I leave the second to Holland, and I will be in um, Eno Couture Europe headquarters in, in Holland. I will be there for three days, and then from there, I go to the launch of Eno Couture Sweden. Oh, my God. Mm -hmm. nice. So now we're going to use a famous diamond moon bit. Here it is, girl. This is going to save you. Ready to get saved? <laughs> let it. Let us change her life with this bit. <laughs> so this bit will remove any dry non-living tissue oh, good. and prep the nail at the same time. So I like to really, really go in and push back those sidewalls and get all that Crusties out. Bye bye, crusties. Emma says hi, Max. Hi, hi Emma. Emma Geraldine says hi, Max. We love you. Big hello from Australia. Hi, thanks for watching today, all the way from Australia. Make sure you like and share this video. She says her sister's a Lebanon nail artist and loves your clothes, your products, and they talk about you all the time. Oh, really? Oh my god, that's so kind. She's gonna make me blush, girl. <laughs> Tomorrow's a really busy day for me too. I have I'm shooting uh, live tomorrow and then from there I have a massage and then I have a facial. <laughs> Before you go? And then I have to go uh, go home and pack. But I should start You're packing not even tonight. Packed. I no. Know you're not. You should that way tomorrow. You're not gonna wanna do it after you have a massage and, and a facial. facial. Don't forget to like and share this video, you guys, so that way a flower is born. Um, Louis, Louis Bear says hi there, Max. Hi, Louise. Are Thanks for watching today. today. 
um, Tamela. I love watching you do nails from South Florida. Thank you so much. I appreciate that. Thanks for watching. Showing love from Texas. Thank you for watching, Maida. And this bit does not hurt, does it, Ness? No, it's like really comfortable. You know me, like I usually get all tense. And, and she's like, oh my gosh. Yeah, I'm relaxed. <laughs> it's been two years, but I'm really relaxed. Like, it's really comfortable. It's like riding a bicycle, right? Of course. No, it's really nice, actually. So did you end up going to um, Hugh's funeral? Because I know you also did some work in the magazine. Oh my gosh, did you stop? <laughs> no. <laughs> Really? Oh, that's that's quite unfortunate. I heard you wanted to get into acting. No, I'm good. Really? I like behind the camera. Really? Last year, Max. Oh my gosh. <laughs> Mida Overa, what bit is that? That was the Diamond Moon bit. I'll show it to you guys one more time. And it's available at enocouture.com. It is this bit. This it's bit. It's really comfortable. Yes. No heat, no damage when used properly. And you can sanitize and disinfect it. You can put it in an autoclave, whatever you need to do, girl. So now we're going to do one coat of prep. And the great thing about our prep is that you can use this for any service. You can use this for nail polish. You can use this for gel for um, acrylic, fiberglass, manicures, anything. And what this does is it balances the pH of the nail and it dehydrates the nail as well. So that way any product you're gonna use it sticks on like glue girl. So now we're going to take our famous tip top nail tips. Oh my gosh, you have 100 people watching this. Can you believe that? 102. Oh my God, yay, 105. <laughs> Thank you so much you guys for watching. I love you guys. I'm Caitlin Jackson. Finally, I get to watch, um, get to catch a full set. So Yay. So you're going to take a little dab of nail glue, just barely on the tip, and you're going to glue the tip just barely touching the free edge. Because remember, you guys, we're going to do our famous trick. Which is? Making the tip look like a sculpture nail. Yes. Get these nails snatched, girl. Tina Pollen, I love your bits. Um, is there a release date for a happy gel yet? Happy gel comes out next week. Everybody's going crazy for a happy gel. And it'll launch um, simultane simultaneously in both Canada and the U.S., I believe. So remember, this nail is going to be one size. Usually, either these three nails are the same size or this one in the middle is one size bigger. And I always, glue, I always put the glue on on the nail because it dries faster. And just glue it barely touching the tip, just like that. Give it five seconds. And then another little bit of glue right on the smile line. So the great thing about our tip top nail tips, and these, this is a stiletto nail tip that we have in clear, is if you file the, the tip of the, uh, of, if you file the tip of the tip, <laughs> it will give you a beautiful coffin shaped nail. Beautiful, look at that. There are your stiletto nails. So fast and so easy. Lovely. Next hand, my dear. Are you gonna be home for Christmas? I will. Are you? I think so. I might I might not be home for um Thanksgiving. Where are you gonna be? Um, nice. China. What? Yeah, I think I'll be in China. When is Thanksgiving this year, anyway? I don't know. Next month. In like, what are we in? I know it's in November. It's the fourth Thursday. In November. In November. Yeah. They just had Thanksgiving in Canada. Susie from Nail Career Education, my homegirl, um, she posted a picture on her Instagram of her cooking a turkey. No way. Yeah, Thanksgiving in Canada, I think it's like October 24th or something like that. Oh, wow. Please mistake me if I'm, I mean, please correct me if I'm mistaken. Sue Howland says hi from Costa Rica. Hi, thanks for watching today. All the way from Costa Rica. I'm going back through if I missed them. Donna says kisses. Donna. Jesse Valdez. Hi, hi Jesse. Kisses, Donna. Amy Masters. Hi, Max. 
Hi, Amy. Thanks for watching today, girl. Beautiful. Look at these nail tips. Oh, sorry. We've got to make sure we're in frame. Oh, my God. Sorry, that was my bad. I'm not watching it there. <laughs> I'm watching here and here. <laughs> So I know you directed some music videos as well, too, right? Oh my gosh, why do you do this to me? <laughs> <laughs> Beautiful. Yeah, I remember we were going to do that one. You didn't let me. <laughs> <laughs> I know. Too much party in your life, Ness. Yours. No, I'm working, making nail products. Making powder in the back. <laughs> Not in my garage. <laughs> so now I'm going to cut the tip. Look at that. Now we have a beautiful coffin shape nail. Not sick. It's crazy. Hundred and twenty five people. Wow, that's because they know that you're here, that's why. It's been two years. They were waiting for you. Mm -hmm. See there you go. Now we just took the magic out of kiving to cut coffin shaped nails. You just cut the tip of our clear tips, of our stiletto tip, and now you have a beautiful coffin-shaped nail. So easy. All these little magic tricks, huh? I know. I'm excited to see the, the end result. Yes. So let's measure them, make sure they're the same size. So I like to measure them from cuticle to free edge. So this one's a little bit longer. This one's a little bit longer. It's because I really like doing long nails, that's why. This one's a little bit longer. Ease me back in there. These two are the same size. Let's see these thumbs. This one's a little bit longer. Make sure you guys like and share the video too. That's very important. There we go. Beautiful. So now we're going to take a 150 grit file and file the perimeter of the nail just to make sure it's nice and snatched. Driel says October 9th, I think, was Thanksgiving. In oh, Canada. in Canada, October 9th? Yeah. Oh, that's right, because it's like barely, it's not even October 24th. I am so I thought, I thought you said the 4th, so I didn't even hear you say the 24th. Sorry, everybody. Zelfia, hi, Max. Hi, Zelfia. She just got ginger. That's it. Oh, really? Thanks for watching. So we just glued on our, oops, sorry, our stiletto nail tips, and we are filing them into a coffin shape because it is so easy, and you get such a beautiful shape if you use our stiletto tips. Cut the tip of it, and you get a beautiful coffin shape automatically. Look at that. And your sides will come out really nice and even and the same. So you're going to save yourself so much time. So make sure you get the shape as perfect as you want it. So that way, when you apply the acrylic, it's going to save you so much time. Have you gone to the salt flats out in Utah? I have. Really? Remember I brought you a big chunk of salt. I know, I remember. You shot a commercial there. Oh, yeah. Mm -hmm. Wasn't it for a car company? Yeah, that's right. They, so they do all the car... <laughs> Commercials <laughs> in the salt the salt flats of Utah. No, it's really neat. It's, I mean, you wouldn't... You can't imagine that something like that even exists. I know. An ocean of salt. It's kind of random, isn't it? It really is. But it seems like it'd look really cool. It really is. And yeah, just don't eat the salt. You know what else is really cool? All the makeup stores in South Korea and Gangnam Street. Wait, is there a what? Oh my god, like a hundred. It's like makeup heaven. It is. Except they only have three shades of foundation. No, they don't. In Korea, oh yeah. My god, Maybe four horrible. if you're lucky. How did you do it? What? How did you shop for makeup? You didn't even have a choice. Well, I like looking really bright, so to me, for me, it's not. A, yeah. And everything has like SPF of a hundred. I was, I was like in heaven. Oh, that's good. Yeah, because the sun is your worst enemy. There we go. Beautiful. Look at that, you guys. Looks just like a sculpture now. Privet, Yasmin, Drazvuche. Look, they do look really good. So now we're going to do our magic trick and we're going to apply one coat of our famous non acid primer over the whole nail. That was because of me. That was because of Ness. Non acid. Non acid. Because she's not about that acid life. Mm -mm.
They do look really good. Oh my god. They look so snatched now. They do. Somebody asked me in one video, they're like, what does snatch mean? And I was no. like, it means cool. <laughs> That's what all the kids say now at the makeup stores. Okay. And so dope. Okay. People say that oh word a lot gosh. too. Okay, so now after you apply one coat of prep, you're going to pinch the nail tip. And because we put a coat of primer on it, it is going to keep the nail tip from cracking. There's a kid at work and he uses get lit. <laughs> oh my god, that sounds so like two years ago. You want to know what's even worse? What? His license plate says get lit. Ew. <laughs> that's so funny. <laughs> get lit. I know, it's so horrible. You're like, that's not happening, buddy. <laughs> it's not. Everybody gives them crap for it. So why are we doing this? So this actually makes the nail tip look just like a sculpture nail. So that way when we overlay it, oh. it's going to have that that really narrow shape already. Because so we amazing mess. put a C-curve in there. Where have I been? Not here. I know. We're going to use our I'm famous sorry. Lux brush wipes, which are on sale. So what happens when you come from a famous family like the Cruz Dashians. <laughs> Shut up. Oh my so gosh, I forgot about that. Our famous cotton candy scented monomer. Love it. The best thing ever. And now we're going to take Eternal Beige. If I can find it. I know it's here somewhere. Yasmin asks, do you put the dehydrator or the primer first? The hydrator. Nail prep. I'm checking. Don't do it. It's called Eternal Beige. I know it's here somewhere and it's hiding from me. What are you looking for? Eternal Beige. Oh, I don't know. There's I know it's here. It's just hiding from me. <laughs> I don't know. I have. I didn't even look for it. Glass pink, Milky Way. I found it. Okay. See, I knew it was here. Oh, okay. That's my signature. There powder. we go. My signature powder. I love it. This is the Nessie Marie color. Yes. And we're going to overlay the whole nail with one really, really, really thin coat. So I'm just going to moisten the nail plate with just a little bit of monomer. A little bit. And then we're going to take Eternal Beige in a medium to um, wet consistency. Angle the nail down. Give it three seconds. One Mississippi, two Mississippi, three Mississippi. Start panning it out from the side towards the side center. Just like that. Oh my gosh, Ness, how do you feel? Excited. Like yourself? Yeah, oh yes, you have no idea. Now, do you want a lot of glitter or just a little bit? Just a hair? Yeah, just a little. Just a little bit? Oh my gosh, that looks good. I miss this color. So beautiful. This was your color. I know it was. She was actually there when we first started about, um, mixing Eternal Beige. She was one of the OG guinea pigs. Yes. Look at that. So beautiful. And this color looks great on every single skin tone, you guys. Especially mine. <laughs> <laughs> um, because it's actually a violet coral base. So both of those colors are really universal on all skin tones. Place your bead, give it three seconds, and then pat it from the side to the side to the center. And this um, layer of Eternal Beige is really, really super thin because we're going to put um, glitter inside and then we're going to encapsulate it with um, glass pink. Are we in frame? Mm -hmm. Okay, good. So if you guys are just tuning in, we are doing a full set of coffin-shaped nails using our stiletto nail tips with Eternal Beige. So don't forget to please like and share this video. Yeah, we have over 200 people watching. Oh my gosh, that's awesome. Thank you so much, you guys. And you can purchase all of our products at enailcouture.com and I'll put a link in the description. You know who was here the other day and she asked me about you? Who? Amber Rose. Oh, did she? Yeah. What is she doing? She's doing really well. Did you see my nephew? <laughs> <laughs> I did, and your godson, too. <laughs> that looks really good. So beautiful. I'm so happy. And remember, keep the acrylic thicker towards the center of the nail. 
so that way the nail it tapers really really nicely just like that what are people saying miss ness um not much right now everybody's quiet um, oh, oh yasmin the one asking about the dehydrator primer for she said the bottle it says it's written primer on prime it's written prime and then pre um, Just follow whatever is on the front of the bottle, my dear. Um, yeah, she also said eternal beige is the way to go. That's right. Catherine Elliott. Hi, Max. Hi, thanks for watching today. Let us know in the comments below where you guys are tuning in from. We have people from all over the world, huh? We have yeah, people from too. Costa Rica, the UK, Australia... In Canada. Canada. America. 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 <laughs> Put that bead of eternal beige right at the cuticle. Angle the nail down. One, two, three. And I love this product because it doesn't run. I just love it. You have so much control over it. That's what makes it so amazeballs. And like with all the traveling I did, like... It never lifted. Because every never. time I would go four weeks without seeing you. Or eight. So it was, sometimes it was long, yes. And you would just... <laughs> I would put, wait it out. <laughs> put glitter on the cuticle. I wouldn't go see anybody. I couldn't do it. It wasn't the same. Big shout out to the Red Cross. Oh, God. I'm not even working for them. It's been <laughs> two years. <laughs> well, Yasmin is from Montreal. Uh, bonjour, Jasmine. Parlez-vous français? Um, Tracy from Detroit. Hi, Tracy. Thanks for watching today. Catherine is from Alberta, Canada. Uh, bonjour, Catherine. Uh, if, make sure you sign up for my class this weekend in Lamcom. Lisa. Hi, Max. Watching from ATL. ATL. Hi. Thanks for watching today. Peggy says hello from Arkansas. Hi, Peggy. Look at that color. It's so beautiful. Michelle Peterson says, Hi, Max. I love your products. I use them in every set I do. Oh, thank you. I really appreciate that. That means the world to me. Amy Masters, Wyoming, America. <laughs> <laughs> Wyoming, America. You know, that's a song. Is it? Jesse, yeah. Let's see. Jesse said, Can you pretty please uh, read the last message to Max? Where is it at? Let's see. Jesse. Oh, it's a long message. Oh, my gosh. It says, hey, I don't want to sound weird or anything, but you inspire me so much, truly. That's Aww. Right. I'm a person who's struggling in life. I hope one day I will be just like you. Oh, thank you. Person. That's really kind. Let me give you a big hug, a big kiss. Here you go. Oh, I love you. Thank you for watching. This one message from one person that lives in a very, very far away country that's never met me before, but they message me every single day to tell me that they miss me and they love me. Oh my gosh. Yeah. Stranger danger. Did you meet them once? They don't do nails or anything like that. They just message me and tell me every day that they love me and they <laughs> oh go visit them in their country. And I was like, I did that. <laughs> <laughs> Telling you to come home. <laughs> <laughs> Sheena Love from Pennsylvania. Hi, Sheena. Thanks for. Make sure you guys check out enalcouture.com. Felicia, Felicia. Hi. Hi, Max from Wisconsin. Hi, thanks for watching today. All the way from Wisconsin, the big W. Which Have one would be the big W, Wisconsin or Wyoming? I don't know. That is the question. That's that the is million, the question. The million dollar question. Maybe Felicia can answer that for you. <gasps> you know who we have to give a big shout out to? Who? Becky. Oh, hi, Becky. Hey, girl. <laughs> also known as The Body. <laughs> Catherine Elliott said, I did see you there. I believe maybe she's talking about Canada. I don't know. I'll have to go back and read that. But I had, I had, I, ugh, I have had some celebrity moments that were really cool, like um, walking at the Walmart in Saskatoon and somebody recognized me. 
Really? Yeah, that was really cool. She was like, are you Max? And I was like, yes. Like everybody would recognize Max. Even in South Korea, I was walking on the street, and then I had a meeting with some business people there, and they're like, we saw you walking on the street, and I was like, do I stand out that much? <laughs> ran into you here at home. <laughs> I, don't go, I don't go anywhere here in Tucson, I actually. <laughs> <laughs> Lynn says, hi, Max. Hi, from Alabama. Hi, Lynn. Thanks for watching today. Dita, hi, Maxi, from Reno. Hi, from Reno. Thanks for watching. And Felicia said, Wisconsin. So I'm assuming that's the big W. Wisconsin is the big W? We live in the big A. Big A. <laughs> The hot A. Big body and the big A. <laughs> <laughs> it is too hot here. <laughs> Juanita, wow. She said amazing. Thank you. You know what it might be the big A, though? Alaska. Yeah. Because that is bigger than, than our state. The last frontier. Have you ever been to Alaska before? Amy says Wyoming. Is Wyoming. The <laughs> uh oh, we got some rivalry. <laughs> to see anything. What do you want to see? Where do you want to go? What is there to see? Well, there's a lot of nature. <laughs> <laughs> Get in tune with yourself. <laughs> I actually got to see some beautiful nature when I was in um, British Columbia on um, Victoria Island. It's really pretty out there. Really? Yeah. I went kayaking. Did you? I don't see you. I yeah, mean, you how could, did they get you to do kayaking? Susie made me do it. Well, she didn't make me do it. I, I, uh, she, ta she talked me about it, and I was like, you know what? Let's go kayaking. Why not? You only live once. YOLO. YOLO. Oh, Catherine. So she's, because I thought she said she met you, but she said, I meant yes, she did sign up for the class in Lacombe. Lamcom. Lamcom. Alberta. Awesome. Can't wait to see you. She said she can't wait to learn from you. You're the awesome. Best. Thank you. That's really kind of you. Um, Samantha says hi from Tijuana. From Tijuana, the big TJ. Darian, hi, Max. Hola. Carla. She says hi. Stephanie. I'm so, oh my gosh. I love so it. beautiful. And that again is Eternal Beige. I don't even need polish. The number one. We can just leave it like that. That's too, too plain. It's We've okay. got to sparkle it up. We're easing We've in gotta there. We've got to sissy that walk. We're easing in there. Where yeah. is the sparkle, sparkle? Uh, Where'd it go? Here it is. Oh, yes. Well, I brought this one too. Mm, no, we're going to use Maxi because you love nude. Okay. So I'm going to encapsulate Maxi gel like nail polish inside of acrylic. Yay. Look at that. Look at how pretty. Oh, my gosh. This is sick. <laughs> so, what is it? So lit? So lit. Oh, gosh. I know. It's ridiculous. Says, hi from Australia. Hi. Thanks for watching today from Down Under. Can't wait to go back to Australia next year in, um, I think it's April. <laughs> Catherine said I said it right. Lacombe. She said it's not Lancome, it's Lacombe. It's not Lancome? <laughs> it sounds cool if you say Lancome. It sounds like a French makeup brand. Thanks, Kevin. Owned by L'Oreal. <laughs> it's Lacombe? Yeah. So now I'm going to take my brush and just dip the tip in a little bit of monomer and blend out the liner demarcation. Check me out now. God, they look so pretty. Look how pretty that is. That was funny. She's like, it's Lacombe, not Lancome. <laughs> I like Catherine. <laughs> <laughs> but doesn't it sound cool when you say lam Lancome? It sounds like you're making it harder for me to say. <laughs> <laughs> Lancome. It looks really good. So pretty, huh? And I wanted to leave on plain. <laughs> it's too plain. This is This is plain, though. For me, I know well, how from when I, we first started, we have friends. Covered in it. diamonds. Look at that, you guys. Looks good. So beautiful. What happens if I said short? <laughs> this is short. <laughs> this is short for the hood. I ease me in there. <laughs> this is short for the hood. God, this is so pretty. It's very, it's very Can Michael. Can just leave it like that? Yeah. Do you know what this is? It's I very.
<laughs> Michael Kors, Michael Kors cruise collection. <gasps> oh my god! Speaking of collections, I am obsessed, you guys, with the new Gucci collection. I need to get me some pieces. It's Gucci. Gucci man. Did you see he got married? Did you watch his wedding? Who got married? Gucci man. Is that a real person? Yeah. Oh, it's a rapper, isn't it? Yes. Oh yeah. Sorry, everything. We're done. Huh. <laughs> um. Yasmin says, I was wondering, can you encapsul encapsulate regular polish? Um, I wouldn't use regular nail polish. I would only use Maxi because it's the best in the world, girl. Mm -hmm. And it's not regular nail polish. Yep. No, it's it's gel like air dry. <clears throat> Donna, you're an awesome nail tech. She loves watching your videos. Oh, thank you. You're an awesome fan. I love you. Um, Ebony, La Ebony, you, are you blending gel polish with monomer? This is actually <laughs> Maxi. Which is this right here? It's a um, lamp free gel. So it's a hybrid nail polish product. So it's a polyurethane based. Um, Sheena, what size brush are you using? I'm using um, the Coconut Petite Macaroon Brush from enocouture.com, which is a size 14. Look at that. So beautiful. Let's just leave them like this. Well, I still got to put clear on top. That <laughs> you don't want any diamonds or anything? Mm. We okay. can put more glitter on the tip if you want to, just to make yeah, it darker on the yeah, tip. Just a little bit. So that we have a, a more um, obvious gradation effect. So I'm going to take a little bit more of Maxi. I'm going to put it over here so that way it's in frame. Just brush a little bit more on the tip. Just like that. That's so pretty. I'm in love. And this color is actually also available in gel polish. So all of the Maxi colors are matching with um, gel polish. So by January of next year, God willing, we'll have every single color of Maxi and gel polish matching. So you'll be able to buy them in a set. Because everybody loves a good set. And Maxi dries in 60 seconds flat. Selena had bought some. Yeah, was, she has. I was using them. They really do dry in 60 seconds, don't they? And they do last good. They last a while. At least a week. Have you answered Donna's question? She says, does it last, does that last long? <laughs> it is. It's a great alternative to um, gel manicures and to nail polish. And this is something um, you can do yourself, too. Mm -hmm. But, of course, seal with Maxi Top Coat. So now we're going to take Glass Pink, which is a completely transparent pink. So it's just going to give the nail a kiss of pink. I'm going to take a new Luxe Brush Wipe, just one. There we go. Boom. And now we're going to encapsulate the whole nail. And right at the cuticle, angle the nail down. Give it three seconds. One Mississippi, two Mississippi, three Mississippi. And start pressing it out. And remember, keep the bulk of the product towards the center of the nail. When did you say you were releasing the happy gel? This um, week? Next week. Next week. Next week, Michelle. Jennifer says hi from Fountain in South Carolina. Hi, thanks for <laughs> watching today. Look at that. What number is the polish? Look at that acrylic, you guys. No bubbles. Look at that, like butter. One twenty is the polish, mm -hmm. and that color is available in both gel polish and in maxi gel like air dry nail polish. Donna wants to know. She says it's very pretty. Um, how long will this last, or does this does that last? The maxi by itself on the natural nail, or this this uh, set of nails. I'm assuming maybe maxi. On the natural nail? Like a week? About a week. Because that's what I was Seven doing. to ten days. While I was in here. While I was MIA. Missing in action. Mm -hmm. I know you spent a lot of time overseas as well too, huh? Yeah, just not with you. <laughs> I was in, you know, Rome and you were in Spain. And I know you spent a lot of time in Italy and France. I was right behind you, my <laughs> <laughs> I'm 
Um, so, Michael Kors. How did I go? Almost two years. So sad. With no nails. I wouldn't even go to anybody else. I couldn't do it. You can't? No. It's called monogamy. Monogamy. Clients and the nail technicians are in a monogamous relationship. That's a hard word to say, huh? Monogamous. Monogamous. Monogamy. <laughs> so what time is your massage? Um, four. <clears throat> oh, okay. Yeah, you have to pack tonight or tomorrow morning. Yeah. I think my flight's like at one, though. Well, you don't want to do it after you get a massage. Why not? I would think you would just want to keep relaxing. <laughs> Go to sleep. Yeah. <clears throat> Ness, you know what you should do? You should start a YouTube makeup channel. You could be the next Jaclyn Hill, whoever that is. I really want that part. Because you know what? I have no <laughs> idea. I just know her by name, but I've never seen one of her videos. Jaclyn Hill? Mm-hmm. I've never seen one of her videos, really. I know everybody was going crazy for Fenty, but... <laughs> Did you try it? I, I won't because it um, <clears throat> is matte, and everybody knows that I like my skin to glow and it's um very or like all the colors are very orange are they yeah to me they look very orange on camera and that's because i think i've said this before in another video is that when makeup is like hd quote unquote that means it's designed for hd cameras mm -hmm. so hd cameras pick up a lot of red and a lot of orange from mm -hmm. the makeup and it has to be on an hd camera and an hd um screen too so you can really see it so like mm -hmm. for example like Sometimes you'll be watching like Real Housewives on an HD TV, right? And you'll be like, "Why does like they have like white under eyes and like the rest you of their can face?" See it all, yeah. yeah, that's from the the lights and the camera. I never knew that. Yeah, that's because their makeup is not HD. Do you remember for a minute everybody was baking their eyes with white powder? I think they still do that. It's just <laughs> not talked about anymore because everybody does that. Baking your face with white powder under. Mm -hmm. <laughs> I remember Nene Leakes called the toy Jackson Casper because of that. She called her what? Casper. Oh my gosh. Are on the show? I think they were on the Celebrity Apprentice oh, with our okay. president. Yeah. <laughs> Jennifer are... says, I only use your wine now because it's the absolute best. That's right. Thank you. Preach yes, it. That is right. Amen. Um, Marmy, is Cover Pink going to be available on Australian website anytime soon? I love your acrylic. It's foolproof to you. Which Cover Pink, my dear? We have Concealer Pink and Makeup Pink and Eternal Beige, and I believe all three of them are available in Australia. Big shout out to enocatoreau.com, Melanie Crow. Ashley May says, hey. Hi, Ashley. Thanks for watching today. Donna says she doesn't wear foundation on her skin. She just uses soap and water. Really? I wish. <laughs> <laughs> I use. Oh, my God. Like, it takes me, like, an hour to get to do. Oh, my God. I know. I, like, I take a radio in. So, like, not a radio, but I take my iPod, my iPhone. So I can listen to music while I'm like waiting for my lotion to dry. Because I have to use like a clear toner and then I use SK2 toner and then I use a face mask and then essence and all this stuff. And it's like, ugh. Mm. I had tried these like little... Like a 10-step skincare program. Things you Look put underneath your eyes. Mm -hmm. You can leave them. They're kind of like little masks. Like they're little strips or whatever. Mm -hmm. And I can't find them anywhere. I don't even remember what brand it was. But I loved it because it just smoothed out like underneath your eyes. Makes it look refreshed. Yeah, it really did. So right now we are using glass pink to encapsulate the nail. And this just gives it a really pretty, it's not really like a pink that's going to overpower. You know what I mean? It's just going to give it like a kiss of pink. Um, Marnie says concealer pink. That it's not on the website. Um, contact Eno Couture Australia. They will be able to help you a lot more than I could. Oh my gosh, Ness, I just remembered. Whatever happened to Mona? She's, She's doing good. Hi, Mona. She got a Facebook. She's a Facebook. Yay, girl. welcome. <laughs> She's still, yeah. She's working. She's 
got like a promotion at work. Good for her. I know she's doing great. What about um? Gosh, did, wasn't she gonna move? Who? The one that she was from Utah, I believe, and she worked with you at the Red Cross. Gosh, we're gossiping. She was from Utah. <gasps> yes. No, I think are you talking? Are we talking about Tina? Yes. She was from here. Oh, she was. She moved though. Oh, bye, Jean. Yep, deuces. Bye, girl. <laughs> bye. All the airtime you get. <laughs> <gasps> what are all the girlfriends saying? There's a lot of people out of my life now. Bye, Felicia. Mm -hmm. But not Felicia that's watching, though. <laughs> no. She's cool. <laughs> oh, man. It's been a long time. Yeah, I'm good with her. I love this color, man. So beautiful, huh? I'm so glad I got it. And now you guys watching know how to do this full set using Maxine Gel Like Nail Polish, Eternal Beige, and... I'm so glad you're Glass home. Pink. And then you're leaving. I know. Home. And then, like, all of November, I'm pretty much gone. It's, this is really why I haven't seen you in two years, because you've been gone. <laughs> <laughs> Taking over the world. Yep. One step at a time. Making the world a pinker place. One nail at a time. <laughs> One nail at a time, that's <laughs> right. <laughs> what does everybody say? Lisa said, just got out of work, and here you are. Hi, Max. Hi. Is it Lisa Trong or Lisa what, Lisa? Lisa Davis. Hi, Lisa Davis. Thanks for watching today, girl. So remember, angle the nail down, and with the tip of the brush, float the product across, because it literally is like how Homegirl said, it's really foolproof. It's so easy to use. There's no other product like this on Planet yeah, Hollywood. I love it. I can't wait till the final results. You really can't tell their tips either now. Nope, because we did a magic trick. Um, oh, Lisa David again says, beautiful work as always. Thank you. Make sure you like and share the video, Lisa, so that way a flower is born. I'm going to get all them. <laughs> they look really good on film, I, don't they? I just missed them. I miss my nails. Thank you so much, you guys, for watching as well. We have almost, oh, we have 220 views. 220, yeah. That's incredible. Thank you guys so much. We have 220 flowers. Beautiful. Looks good. There's so long. And then this is the color we use to encapsulate. Oh my God. Glass pink. You feel like yourself again. So I now we're going to start shaping these bad boys. I needed Max back in my life. You needed some Maxi. You know who ca helped me come up with the name uh, Maxi for the nail polish? Who? My dear homegirl, Julie Candelac from uh, NYC. Oh, really? Yeah. So this acrylic is quite not dry yet. So we're going to use our other little magic trick, and we're going to apply a coat of cuticle oil over the acrylic, and this will actually help speed up the catalyzation process. Michelle asked, will this work with your precious mineral gels? Um, you can try it, but you would have to cure it. I don't know if she's talking. Maybe she's talking about because how you did the... Inside and then encapsulated yes. it? You can definitely do that. Yeah, of course. You just have to cure it and then encapsulate it. Layer. Jonas is beautiful. I'd wear that. Thank you. It's very, very sheer and very, very sophisticated. Marilyn says, I love the nails. Thank you. Thanks for watching, girl. Um, I think it's Haley Marie, the absolute highlight of my year watching you work in person at the Beauty Expo in Sydney. Oh, thank you. That's really kind of you. <laughs> I feel like everybody sees you more than I do now. <laughs> <laughs> I spent about a month in Australia. Oh, did you? Yeah. And the other day I woke up and I was coming to work and I thought I was in Australia for a minute because what? there is an emu running on the side of the street. No. I swear to, to Bible. Bible. <laughs> there is an emu, and it wasn't an ostrich, it was an emu. And no, I was like, am I in no. Australia? Because, I mean, it's very, that's not common, but it's probably more common to see 
Emu's on the side of the street in Australia than it is here in Disneyland. In Disneyland. Did you know they're building us a theme park or something like that? They keep saying that, but they can't build one here. Do you know why? Why? Because of the weather in the summer. It's horrible. Yeah. And if they had an indoor theme park, it would cost like a billion dollars a day for the AC. They're not going to put that much money. Yeah. But if all goes according to plan, in December when I'm in Japan, I will visit the Hello Kitty theme park. And Osaka. Are you, do yeah. they have a theme park? I think there's like two or three. Oh my god. I think Hong Kong has one too. How exciting. Hong Kong, I've never been to Disneyland. I always say, oh, I'm going to go to Disneyland in Hong Kong this year. I think that would be pretty amazing. But I've, some of my friends have told me that it's not that great because it's really small. But still, to be able to say that you did Disneyland like worldwide. That's it. Um, Madeline, what was that pink stuff you brushed on right now? Cuticle oil. It actually helps the polymerization process. So now I'm going to take the pink diamond barrel bit, which is right here. And we're going to... Um, Amanda? Mm-hmm. She said, Canada. Come home already. Love watching, right? He is home. He's home. <laughs> oh, he's home. <laughs> <laughs> so now we're going to start shaping these bad boys. Wither. Look at that. Look at that shape. It's so beautiful, huh? Yes. Beautimus Maximus. Life. And you cannot tell these are nail tips. You can't really. I was a little... Apprehensive. <laughs> I was. Hello Kitty theme park. I can't get over that. Wouldn't that be fun? I had no idea. I wonder if Becky works there. Who knows? Probably. Who knows where she is? I don't know. At the Playboy Mansion. Taking over. Taking, literally. <laughs> Knocking down doors. Donna asked, what shape is this? Coffin, my dear. It's my shape. <laughs> it's the Nestle Marie shape. She's the inventor of the shape. <laughs> yeah. She kind of is. I feel like you didn't want to do this on me for the longest time. That is true. I you, have to admit. You did not want to. I wasn't feeling it for the longest time. You weren't. And now I'm about that life. But I don't like the name Coffin. I like the name Ballerina. It just sounds prettier. Because nobody really likes talking about coffins. You know what I mean? I do. My brother has a little girl. I can't believe that. She's going to be a year now. Her name is Jasmine. Oh, my gosh. And Mr. Roundface, how's he doing? <laughs> really big. My nephew's 13 now. Oh, my gosh. No. 13 or 12. One of those two. No. Yeah. He's really it funny. Hasn't been that long, man. No. He looks the same, though. Does he? Yeah. How's he doing with the baby? Um. Okay. Yeah. Mm -hmm. I mean, that's different. If he's a teen... The little baby running around. Yeah, there's a lot. There's a big age gap between them. Well, you know, Malia, like, she's doing fine with, like, the baby, and I didn't know how that was gonna work out. Turn out. She's used to being the only one. Let me know if you guys in the comments have siblings. Amanda says hi. Oh, she's saying hi to someone else. Hi, Lucy. Lucy Frank is watching, also known as the Eagle. The Eagle. The Eagle. El vuelo del águila de Lucy Frank. Pronto, Lucy, los productos estarán disponibles en Liverpool, en toda la República Mexicana. Um, Tanya says, what file bit is this? This is the smooth top barrel. 
Oh, she answered that. Lucy Frank answered that. Part. What did she say? <laughs> the bit is the top barrel. <laughs> <laughs> this, I'm sorry, this is not the smooth top barrel. I lied. This is just the regular barrel. Ashley May has five sisters. Oh, my gosh. Oh, I know. I just thought of that, too. And you guys can see that the dust is, like, super heavy. So you don't have to yeah, worry about the dust going fly. anywhere. It does not fly. Because the last thing I want is dust on my beat mug. <laughs> right? And a beat mug is a face that is painted. Especially for me because I like um, my cushion foundation is really sticky because it's so moist. So, like, all the dust would stick on my face and it doesn't. Can you imagine what you would feel like going out, going home at night? Ooh. No point. No. Yeah. Sorry. I'm so pretty. Donna has three. They're all married. Oh, awesome. Oh, Tanya says thanks, Max. I need more bits. Make sure you visit enalcouture.com. How about you, Lucy Frank? How many siblings do you have? Amanda Morgan is watching. Oh, my gosh. I need to practice my acrylic. My the Amanda's my ride or die. Oh, my God. Yeah. Friend. She's from Saskatoon, Saskatchewan. Shout out to you, girl. Love yous. We have to party next time I'm in Albert, in, Albert, in um, Saskatoon. Um, Lisa Forrester, Max, I thought you mentioned once your fur babies. How many do you have? She has two. She has two dogs? Fur, yeah. Um, I have, I have 15 dogs. Did you guys give all the puppies? Um, yes. Max? We have, a, we have 15 dogs, but I live in an acre of land. Okay. And my dad takes care of them. But I have, um, chihuahuas, I have Chinese crescents, and Pomeranians. I thought they were Pomeranians, yeah. And um, a lot of my Chinese crescents have Russian names. Um, Mika, I'm the baby of four. Oh, wow. I'm the baby of two. Lucy Frank, I don't know what she said. Eleven altogether. Oh, my God. That's a big family. I think that'd be fun growing up in a big family, especially during the holidays. Um, the Ebony, the Ebony, I have sisters, um, makeup artist, esthetician, cosmetologist, and then her brother is a real estate agent. Wow, so they're all set. That'd be kind of cool, like, if you have a lot of kids and, like, they all have different careers that you, like, need, like, an attorney, and <laughs> <laughs> a dentist, a doctor, a plastic surgeon, <laughs> oh, a plastic surgeon, that's right. Oh, I need life. Beautiful. Max has the ugliest dog. I was Fan just Bing. reading that as you read it. <laughs> Fan Bing Bing is beautiful. And she's hilarious. That dog is... She's a genius. She has the most expressive eyes. Fifteen dogs. I posted their pictures some um, I like little you clips. I didn't have fifteen dogs two years ago. I didn't. What happened? The well, puppies happened. Puppies happened, and then we found a little male dog the other like a few weeks ago on oh on the God. street, and he had no collar on or anything like that. So we he kept him. Did you check if he was chipped? Um, Mike yes. Chipped. So he probably was like at somebody's house and he escaped, or I don't know. Wow. I, I hope I'm hoping they didn't throw him away, but we kept him, and we named him Pinky. Amanda Morgan says, must bring dogs with you. No, I don't travel with my dogs. That's too much, girl. Lisa Forrester, you can see my two fur babies in my profile picture. Oh, let me see. I can't see. There we go. So now we're going to take the pink diamond cuticle bit, and we're just going to go over the cuticle and get it really blended and snatched. Just like when you do your contour, you got to blend it out, girl. <laughs> blend out that line. We don't want to look like a football player. I don't know. I look good. I'm the happiest person in the world right 
Last year. Last year. No, thank you, thank you. So what else is going on in the world of Max? Um, I'm shooting a commercial. A commercial? Uh-huh, in what? China. What? Yeah, in November. Are you going to post it? Yeah. Are you? Of course. Can you see it? I'm going to say a big shout out to Nessie Marie in the commercial. Yeah. What, what? Yeah. I'm going to say, Dasha how, Nessie Marie. What is that? Dasha how. Hello. Oh. We're going to go over the side of walls one more time. Um, Lucy Frank. Oh, she's just. So the cuticle bit is finally back in stock in Canada. In Canada. Um, Carmen Bryce. Hi, Max. Newbie to your line. Thank you I'd, for watching. I'd like to know how clear the crystal clear is. Is like, it like glass? Like flawless, girl. Flawless. Jane Mo, thank you from Washington. You're welcome, Jane. Thanks for watching today. Tanya says, I love my cuticle bit. Thank you. I love you, Tanya. Thank you for watching. So make sure you like and share the video. So when did you say you're going to the Hello Kitty theme park? Uh, when I'm in Japan. November? Um, it'll probably be early December. If all goes as planned. Lucy wants to know how many languages do you speak? Um, let's ask the fans and let me know if you guys know how many languages I speak and what they are. I should say, where are you from? Where am I from? <laughs> Disneyland. <laughs> Disneyland. But Lucy Frank was born in Brazil, but she was raised in Italy. Oh, really? Yeah. Lucy Frank. Lucy Frank is the managing director of Enoch Tour Canada. Mm. Beautiful. So now we're going to flip the hand over facing the client's view and just snatch the free edge and make sure it's nice and even. Let's do the thumb. I'm going to bevel out the free edge one more time just to make sure it's nice and even. Donna said, do you speak hardcore Italian? Lucy does. Callie Mercer says six. Tanya says five languages. Is she correct? Close. It's four. Hardcore Italian. I don't speak Italian, but I like old Italian songs. Luca says he speaks ten like me. <laughs> he speaks ten languages. Carmen Bryce says French, Italian, and English. That's all I've heard so far. And I speak a little bit of Chinese, well, Putonghua, which is Mandarin. And I can also speak some, um, a little, little bit of Korean. Onion Chingu. And then I also speak some Russian, Japanese pretty decently. I can speak some Australian. <laughs> you reckon? What? That's what they say in Australia. You I reckon, love you reckon. I love it when my homeboy Johnny Depp fam says you reckon, Max. What I, does that mean? You reckon? Like, but what does it mean? Like, what? It, what How is, would you explain you reckon? Um, you reckon? Yeah, you reckon. Like, hey, Ness, you want? Let's do this, and you're like, you reckon? Like, are you sure, kind of, or yeah? Right. Mm -hmm. I guess it could mean whatever you're. Yeah, it, it depends on the occasion. It's however you're choosing it. Oh. You reckon? You reckon? Uh huh. How do you spell that? Like wrecking ball? That's what I'm like. <laughs> I don't know. You reckon? That's it's so different. Sounds cool though, huh? Sure, it's like fetch. 
You're going to start saying you reckon now. <laughs> right. Let's make that happen in America. Let's see. Donna. Really, Donna? Donna, do you like old Italian music? Like, I love Rafaela Carrà and Romina Power with Albano, uh, Rece Pevori. Oh, Tanya says all Spanish. Oh, in Spanish, too. I forgot I spoke Spanish. Oh, La Ebony or Ebony. I don't know how to say your name. I'm sorry. But it says you reckon. Oh, it's, and it's R-E-C-O. Oh. <laughs> but it's do you think. Or you think. Tanya says you reckon equals you think. You reckon? <laughs> you th Why don't you just say you think? <laughs> That's so, but okay, so how do you use it? Like, hey, Ness, do you think that we should go out today? And no, you're but like, you hey, you reckon. So that would be my response, you reckon. Yeah. But it means you think. So am uh, I asking you a question or am I, or am I saying, yeah, let's go? I'm so confused with this. I need an Australian person too. <laughs> Help us out. Yes, please. Okay, it's La Ebony. La Ebony. I like that. Okay, Peggy Bishop says, um, Reckon is you think, I guess, all in your delivery. It's all in the delivery. Exactly, that's how life is. It's all in the delivery, girl. Now we're going to take the famous smoothie buffer. Yuko Matsuyama-san, konnichiwa! She says hi and back. So this ne. Yuko-san. Lisa says you reckon. Yes, reckon is also a southern thing. Really? Yes. I've never heard southern people say you reckon. That's what she said. Lisa Forrester. So I'm taking my smoothie buffer and wherever I pass my file, I'm just going to smooth out those edges so that way these nails are not too sharp, you reckon? So I, yeah, I reckon. <laughs> and then also in both Australia and in um, the UK, they say like the boot of the car. Latoya Hill. Hi, Max. Just received my diamond moon cuticle bit in the mail today. Can't wait to use it. Oh, I hope you love it, girl. I think we're out of frame. Are you reckon this? I reckon. So I'm going to take my Twiggy file because I'm all about that shape. We're all about that life, right? Yes, I'm, I don't know what that is. There we go. We're going to take a Twiggy file, which is this really, really thin, narrow white one. Okay. And we're going to get that sidewall really nice and tapered. Yeah. And, and I want red. <laughs> yeah. No, thank you. We can do red for the holidays. Next time. <laughs> Beautiful. So beautiful, huh? I love it. You really can't tell the tip. I'm, my mind is blown. Now everybody knows the magic technique. Jesse says good night, friend. I love Jessie you. Says, I have to be up in the morning. Yes, yeah, she says I love you. She says, you reckon we should, I'm not understanding the sentence, but um, that road kill off the road, usually a deer straight to the freezer. <laughs> you reckon? Um, Madeline, I am so happy to see the way you do your sets are exactly how I've been doing my sets lately. And they have been a thousand times better. This oh, awesome. It makes me happy. Thank you. Thank you for watching. Beautiful. Okay. He is amazing, yeah. So now we're going to remove the dust. 
Oops, sorry, I forgot to take going with my Twiggy. They look so beautiful. So beautiful, Maximus. I wanna cry. They're really long, Max. They're not that long. You didn't listen to me. <laughs> what, is, what does everybody think? These nails are not that long, right, girls? For a lab, girls and boys. For working in a lab, they are long. <laughs> it's been two years. <laughs> <laughs> oh, that's, I can't get over the um, Lacombe. <laughs> I can't get over it. It's, it's not lamb comp, it's Lacombe. <laughs> get it right, Max. Get it right. Don't get it twisted. <laughs> so now I'm going to take a Lux brush, wipe saturated in acetone. And we're going to cleanse the nail. Um, let's see. Gloria, I'm watching with my mom and enjoying every minute. Oh, thank you for watching. I hope you guys are having fun watching. Lisa Forrester said perfect. Thank you. I appreciate that. Make sure you like and share. Latoya said that's a great link. They are, but I work in a lab, and I don't know if I could how much I could do with them. <laughs> Look at that. Oh, my gosh. What a difference. They're snatched. And now we're going to finish, of course, with the number one gel top coat in the world, Yay. Shiny Gel. I want this on first. Mm -hmm. um, let's see. And float it on, girl. Callie says love longer the better. Donna, wow, they're they're beautiful. They look like a glass slipper. And yes, Peggy, I will enjoy them. They are gorgeous. Look at that. Oh my gosh, Max, what a difference! Like, oh. I'm these, in heaven. These are the hands of Nessie Marie. I've missed him these past two years. Jeez Louise, that was a long time. I went by quick, but still. Madeline, yes, thank you for the responses. I'm cheesing on the couch with my sister. Oh, you're welcome. <laughs> Love long nails. Latoya, um, you'll get used to the length over time. Yes, I've, I think I've been longer than this. Yeah, definitely, and pointier. Yeah, and pointier. I think I've gone through all the phases with Max. All the shapes. Yes, everything. If you go through my Instagram, actually, a lot of the posts are, are you. Me. <laughs> Remember when we did the bottoms? The red bottoms, yes. yes. Well, they were gold. It was red on top, gold bottoms. That was me. God, how pretty do they look? So I'm just removing any excess gel that might have run onto the side. I'm so in love right now. Just to keep the shape of the nail. And then we're going to bake this 90, um, 60 seconds, actually. Just 90. Oh. There we go. Oh. Hold on. I need to move that nail. I have it in there. Okay. <clears throat> And shiny gel just is the best thing Gosh, ever. They look so good. I can't get over them. Look at shiny gel. And you can use this with any system, you guys. Do you get on Instagram? Yeah, you do. Because I get your... Um, Lives on Instagram? Mm -hmm. You I usually do it when I'm working. <laughs> more and let me tell you why because on facebook the lives will be there forever and ever and on instagram they're there 24 hours and then they're gone and the quality of the video is higher on on, on facebook, facebook. Mm -hmm. tracy hitson says very nice they look great You know what we didn't mention once this whole time I've been here? What? We have not talked about Bojangles. <gasps> oh my god! It closed down. No, it didn't. It did, Bible. Oh man, I haven't even gone anywhere and I didn't even know that. Jeez Louise, girl. Where have yeah. you, you've really been living under rock for the past two I years. I really have. Okay, we can switch it now. Look at that. Beautiful. What do you guys think? Do you love it? I love it. That's all that matters. <laughs> Look how beautiful that is. So stunning. Mm -hmm. Eternal beige, maxi 120, glass pink, and shiny gel.
Nobody has hands like Nessie Marie, though. Oh, my God. Let's get some I cuticle oil so on them, though, first, though. I know. My hands are so bad. Working in a lab does not do good for me. So after the hands come out of the lamp, we're going to wait 60 seconds, and then we can put cuticle oil on. I'm sorry, um, 30 seconds. Amanda Morgan says perfection. Um, Madeline, she wants to know if you can say I do nails in all the languages you know. She wants to hear it. I can try. Jeez Louise, that's hard. Oh my <laughs> God, girl. Give me something easy, like, hi. <laughs> His intro to the video was really great, actually. I was sitting here amazed <laughs> watching him. Day in and day out. <laughs> um, Callie Mercer says, I can't wait for when for Tuesday and Wednesday. Um, um, Callie, Lisa, Tracy, and Latoya, um, they all say they love him. Thank you. I love you. Sorry. Stop me. Donna, I know. I'm sorry. I'm trying to read. <laughs> Donna says um, they're awesome. No, she says she wants them to be. They are beautiful, Donna. And then I think it's Yuko. Yuko san. Uh, From says, Inaka, so Japan. I love them. Arigato gozaimasu. Let's see. Can I say I do nails in every language? Let me try. Um. Uh, <clears throat> Boku wa neristo. That was Japanese. Um, jeez. Yo soy técnico de uñas. That's Spanish. I'm a nail tech. That's English. Three. Because I do nails. Ya master nail, nail artist. That's Russian. Ya master. Would you tell? How beautiful. What was I thinking? <laughs> You can't leave me anymore. Look at that, you guys. You can't leave me anymore. So beautiful. I will not have it. Keiko-san said, beautiful. <laughs> Arigato gozaimasu. You can't. You got to make sure you're here at least every two weeks now. You know that. <laughs> at least once a month. No. We can't do once a month. I'm here. Beautiful, you guys. I hope you love this set. Thank you so much, Ness. Oh, there we go. Angle this hand a little bit more up and relax the fingers. There we go. Beautiful. Let's get a wide shot of that. There we go. Bring this hand a little bit closer in so that everybody can see the fabulousness. Thank you so much, you guys, for watching today. I love you guys so, so much. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. And thank you, Ness, for being such an amazing model. And I will see you guys in the next live video. I love you guys. Have a great night. Bye-bye. Kisses.